welcome back to my channel again for another draft video today and this is gonna be I, I mean I always say this but this is gonna be a good one we have a really fun theme and I think our team probably gonna be fire we're looking at the best players in the NBA we're drafting some of them in history who are absolutely the best at handling balls do you see me laughing I'm laughing at handling balls D was good tonight, so we gotta make sure our D stay good. I'm sorry, I just, somebody was gonna make that joke in the comment section, so I just thought, let's, you know, let's put it in here, you know? It's out there, okay? We don't need to talk about it anymore. But anyways, as you can see here, we're on 2 Empty Central, as always, and today, we're gonna sort by the players. We are gonna sort by the players with the best ball handling. Now, obviously, every card that's, like, amazing is gonna be up here, like Dwayne Wade, you know, Steph Curry, but a guy like Allen Iverson, Kyrie Irving, yeah, they're, like, easily some of the best in the history of the league, and we low-key got some gems in here, like Jamal Crawford, Jason Williams, you know, diamonds, but that are stacked in terms of their ball handling ability. Some of these cards might just pop up on our team today now i am going to start with two cards in my lineup that i don't have to draft i'm putting them in there because i want to the first one will be this kyrie irving card because i just picked them up for spin to win if you missed that check out the episode i uploaded yesterday the card is sick i want to use him more plus he's arguably the best ball handler of all time at least in the current nba and the other card we're going to use without drafting him thon maker because you know we're going to have trouble finding big men for a ball handling draft like it's just i don't know if we'll get any but this boy thon check it out has an 85 ball handle as a center but without further ado we're going to rip eight rainbow packs hopefully Hopefully we get some big man so we can actually have a lineup and we'll see what our draft gives us let's get right to it additionally guys today's video is sponsored by raid you can download raid shadow legends on ios android now even desktop which is super cool by using the links down below in the description i mean boys look at this right here i am on my apple iphone and look at how good this game looks this is an rpg game which usually i wouldn't play but when it looks this good i'm into it look at this i'm gonna just give you a taste of how awesome this is all right this move right here called the hellraiser watch watch the damage this does boom it took out it took out one of them in one move um oh and it's still my turn how would i just end this battle real quick a little arrow action right there it's that easy bruh oh look at this i lied it's not that easy one of my champions is down they just they went for her only i'm just i'm just gonna be honest here i am not i'm not thinking i can do this but we'll see okay quick little attack there i've got this one now curse blade this is like my last hope can i win this battle come on come on bro no just Okay, I'm good. I'm good. She's done, right? Let's go. Victory. Barely. I barely survived that, bro. I don't even know how I did. And I got a new champion for it. I will take it. As you can see, I still have a lot of learning to do in this game. But Raid Shadow Legends, one of my favorite things about it, in addition to how good it looks and how smooth it feels, is that it's super user friendly. I'm a noob, but all the tutorials and information they give you makes it like super easy to pick up and play. In addition, the highly anticipated battle pass is on. Season one is live and you can win some awesome rewards, including free energy refill gems and upgraded artifact sets as well new epic and legendary champions for fulfilling daily and weekly challenges so honestly what are you waiting for go down i'll say it again links in the description click them you'll get 50,000 silver and a free epic champion as part of the new players program to help you start your journey don't waste any time i'll see you guys in there and we're starting off of some light which is a diamond oh oh okay i would guess that's obviously going to be lebron right like this davis bertans card super nice but unless reggie jackson has some wild ball handling rating like nah this would really hose me if it was reggie jackson okay he's at an 83 i'm like slightly concerned here this isn't point guard lebron he's got an Can't go down. <laughs> Are you kidding me? All right, so we're we're starting off with a gold Reggie Jackson. Can I at least cheat and put the Amethyst Reggie Jackson in there? I think I deserve that. Like, how are you not gonna give me LeBron? Okay, regardless if it's the gold or the Amethyst Reggie Jackson, clearly that's not what we wanted, okay. but okay, okay, that is. I'm a little worried here, man. I'm a little worried because we're gonna get so many point guards, but obviously, even though it's the trash, not prime series version, we're gonna have to take this Russell Westbrook. That Russ really has like a 73 ball. I am just, I am not excited to use him but we might Monster be excited to use one of these cards okay this is interesting i want to say it's going to be my guy gerald wallace which would be clutch but i don't know about this dennis schroeder i don't have this ruby card but i guess we'd have to use a different dennis schroeder this ruby dennis schroeder has an 88 ball handle yeah that's going to be tough to beat gerald wallace technically a power forward would help my lineup so much bro just let it be just let it be no 86 
bro. And in fact, we'll have to take the Amethyst Dennis Schroeder because I don't have that promo one. And this card has a 90 ball handle. Does Dennis Schroeder even have any sick like ball handling, ankle breaking highlights? Like make it worth it? And nothing runs for the magic. Bolts goes down. Oh, he really does. Okay, I can't be mad, Dennis. Look at this though. We filled out half our lineup, of course, with the two cards I included off the top. Um, four point guards so far. <laughs> okay. But let's see if we can't turn our luck a bit, get at least like a small forward or something. Come on. As we are looking at <gasps> Okay, okay. I'm just I'm I'm just saying this right now. If there was one center in the NBA other than Thawne Maker, who we already have, that has handles, like we know it's Nikola Jokic. I mean, just the dude has ankle breakers. Let, let me show you. Yeah. All right, we've got our two centers, and I think legit, like we know Jokic is arguably the best ball handling big. Now let's get back to some fire ankle breakers. Oh, they, oh, look at this. We get two big men here. Drummond, not so much. David Robinson, low key, just a little something, something in there. I think it's between Richardson and Levine. We'll even check out this Alfred. Alfred Payton, 83 ball handle. No way a dude named Alfred is making my team. Just no way. Base Levine, get out of here. 84 ball handle. Nah, we're going Opal, aren't we? Jason Richardson, an Opal card with the evolution. 89 ball handle. That's low key, not very high for an Opal, but Jason Richardson also has the greatest name in the history of the world. And I'm not talking about Richard. I'm excited, man. I put so much time into getting that Opal J Rich, evolving him and everything, and I literally never use him. So this will be fun. As what does this pack give us? I'll this pack back. gives us, okay, three big men and my guy, Shea Gilgis Alexander. All right. Okay, since we've got an overload of point guard shooting guards now, I'll drop this Reggie Jackson back to the official gold, which I drafted him at. We just, we, we won't really use him. I got Shea, I got Russ. I need some other positions here, so we might have to ignore some point guards here. Um, Let's just see what we get. This happens literally every draft video where like I get either too many big men or too many point guards. It's just a thing. I can't take this Calvin Murphy Ray. If Ray has above an 83 ball handle we'll take him because that's respectable oh nope. ray uh oh ray 78 that's bad that's how what about tyler hero tyler hero the uh the sapphire only a 76 oh wait a minute he can evo what is his his evo gives him an 86 that might even be higher than this calvin murphy i mean i highly doubt it but we'll take this tyler hero moments card for our lineup to be legit on 2k uh in 2k20 i need two power forwards here i don't that's not gonna happen is it is it okay okay yes yes it is loki this tatum might have uh, he's going up against three point guards there's literally three versions of tatum that are better than this one but we'll see what is uh his ball handle 81 that's not that's not very good you know what even the next tier up the diamond card jason and Tatum 86 and you want to talk about a guy who can play power forward and who has handles um Jason Tatum's broken some ankles in his day All right, and we need one more power forward eligible player. Uh, this this ball handler is right. It's getting out of control, man. We are we are taking random cards. That's my guy, Jimmer. Can I make an exception? No, no I can't use Jimmer again. I too many point cards, okay? Sorry, Jimmer. There was also no power forwards in that pack at all. What do we got here? Mo Peep, a small forward slash small forward. That's stupid. 2K, fix your game. Okay, okay, this is the one. This is why I promise this was the next pack. Lamar Odom. They gave this dude, Lamar Odom, an 86 ball handle. He might be the best ball handler in this pack. I mean, they probably juice Muggsy Bogues, but 86 ball handle on a power forward? You know Lamar's gotta be in here. He probably has some ankle breaker highlights too. There's Kristich now, mismatched on Lamar Odom. Odom still on the... Ooh, don't do it. Break me off a little something. I'm not gonna lie, we actually have a lot of really sick ball handlers on this team. Like even Tatum and Odom, who we stretch for, like they're legit. Jay Rich, come on now. Tyler Hero's a walking bucket. Nikola Jokic, a big man who can break ankles. I can't wait to see how this team looks in 2K. Give me a couple minutes here or like two seconds of real time uh, in this video. And look at our lineup here, looking very, very nice. Okay, we got a couple Opals, Kyrie, J. Rich. We got some big men ball handlers, Thon, Jokic, Odom, Tatum. Yeah, this team looks it. I'm excited for this hero card. They literally just dropped a new pink diamond hero from the spotlight sim, that moments, whatever they're doing. So I'm gonna see if his jump shot and stuff is cool. I don't remember using that card. So here we go. We got a ball handling team here. Let's get it. And who's our victim today? Oh no. Oh, uh, see. He's running a five man that that gives me a good hope he's only an 87 overall but i really gotta go up against point guard glitch lebron again it's like every video bruh yes we got our orange accessories with our home duke jerseys you love to see it i'm coming around okay i, I like the i like the orangeness all right oh oh kyrie 
Kyrie did it to him. Oh no, Russ. Oh, okay. This Russ only has a 73 point shot. Kyrie had the handles on LeBron, got past him. Only a 73 point shot on Russ, but I was using the uh, the better version of him for so long. I know his jump shot back and forth. So, well, mm, gotta play defense. Probably still be able to hit with Russ. In fact, let me try something. Let me try something. In my No Money Spent series, I made this move like 17,000 times over the past two weeks. Russ. Even this one hits it. Okay. Yeah. It, Russell cards this year, once you learn that timing on his jumper, are so lethal. I'm not even going to lie. He's coming out and taking twos because he's got this LeBron. You know, it's easy to just go to the rim. But uh, I'm taking threes, bruh. Right here. Here's another. Here's another with the green. I'm locked in. I am locked in recently, boys. Oh, look at Tatum. Look at Tatum, you hero. He's at, yes, backcourt. He's in here for his ball handling, but look at that ball slap. You know what I'm saying? What? I don't, I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm sorry. Yeah, Clay, you better step out on this, Russ. And I'm gonna take advantage of that as I'm gonna bust it with Jason Richardson. Okay, lock. Offensively, we are absolutely locked in. Gotta find a way to get stops here, which we, we should here. No problem. <sighs> Alonzo for three. Get out of here. All right, we good. We good. Run this floor, Jay Rich. Uh, run this floor, Thought Maker. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we've established my offense is here. Can we get stops though? Okay, this is tough. We got a little. Oh, opponent's got his mic plugged in. Wonder if he knows me. Wonder if he's trash talking me. We'll never know until I edit this video at least. Uh, good. <laughs> That was, that was a perfect rotation Tyler Hero just got smashed on. Okay. What I was trying to say is we definitely have some comp here. Like, this is this is tough. Jokic? Uh, I don't know that jumper. It's good, though. Okay, I'll figure it out. It's really hard to defend five out in this game, which he's running, when you have some non-clamps players out here, because, like, he can just blow by pretty much at will. But maybe we'll figure it out. Speaking of blowing by, Dennis Schroeder almost got blocked, but we'll take it. Oh, good step back, Tyler Hero. Let's go. Let's go. Filling it up. I do not like that jump shot, but I did like that cross. All right, bench. Good stuff. Let's go. Jokic transition. Jokic transition. Oh, yeah. Step back. Step back. No. What? Who's... Okay. Whose idea was it to put this dude on the team? Uh, good stuff, Tyler Hero. We didn't get the ball back, but that's kind of good stuff. Man, I'm in tough here. This Jokic is kind of selling me right now. There we go, Jokic just beating the buzzer. Okay, no matter how uh, how good my opponent is, he's solid. Like, my team uh, isn't great defensively. We're still in this game, which is huge. A fadeaway three with Lonzo Mourning. I honestly might have quit the game if he had just hit that. Like, that would have been, been something else. Give me that lead. Lamar Odom, right there. Okay, I'm good. I just need to lock in in this game. I need this dub, man. I'm on a roll recently. I want to keep that going. All right, boys, let's go. One point lead, fourth quarter. That means uh, this game is on me to win. It's on me to win right now. Oh, Shea? Shea on Alonzo Morning? Yep. What? <laughs> Alonzo Morning jumped and then morphed after I pumped it. That's crazy. That that was like a superhuman ability right there by Alonzo Morning. And my camera's full. Oh, and Clay Thompson's hitting a three on me. Is it? Oh, he missed. Okay. Oh, look at Jokic. Jokic with the green before I could reset my camera. Okay. Yeah. Are you going to quit? That would be nice. Okay, we're, we're back here. Uh, 2K just let LeBron James get an and one on me. Like, I don't really think they want me to win here. It's all good, though. Uh, I can't make that pass out. He was wide open for three. Oh, okay. Here's the plan. If Alonzo Mourning beats me shooting jump shots and threes and early release post fades, like, that just is what it is, man. He's just five out. Oh, this is... Uh, this, this game... This is nothing new. I've seen everything this dude's done by... <laughs> Pass the ball where oh my goodness i had thon maker and they just didn't let me pass it to him okay finally finally his alonzo morning misses okay uh kyrie right to the rim yeah sure sure good dunk kyrie okay we're gonna need a stop and a three that's very doable yes go to this clay i know what he wants to do he's gonna hit me with the behind the back move um oh okay he did he did something different there uh let's go let's go thon yes we're, we're just worried about this clay that's it we're not worried about if alonzo morning Ah, that's... Okay, well, I mean... He just keeps passing out of shots without repercussions. That's wild. I literally just can't get a stop on this dude. That's crazy. I I'm really disappointed. If this is how I lose... Uh, Kyrie, wait, Thon. Yep. What was that? Just make the pass to the wide open dude. I need a three here, Kyrie. I need a three. Otherwise, I mean, this game might already be over. But, uh, if you don't... Oh, that's... Oh, that shot release was terrible. 
Okay, um, I don't know. Maybe I can do something crazy here. Maybe he turns this ball over. That would have been nice. Foul. Okay. All right, and I couldn't get a stop there. I lost. There's no way I should have lost this game. I shot 67%, 57 from three. I don't, that's, that's a tough loss. He turned on his mic too. I really hope he was trash talking. Like, good win, good win. I'm not surprised that defense was my downfall because of course I wasn't using defenders. I was using ball handlers. Kyrie and Thon did lead our team pretty good. Um, yeah, I don't know. Offensively, we were great. Just couldn't get a stop. That's it. His uh, Alonzo Mourning of all people killed me. That's pretty embarrassing for me, actually. I should have figured out a way to stop him. But I hope you all did enjoy this draft video. Best ball handlers, if you did, drop a like down below. Let me know what you thought of it and which one you'd like to see next week. I'll see you then.